Hey guys, thank you for selecting this video. I will show you how to make a custom cursor and or cursor set. First thing, here is my cursor. Check it out if you like it. You may not like it, I like it, that's why I'm using it. This is my custom wallpaper. I did it like in less than a minute, so it's not really nice. If any one of you know how to make cool wallpapers, please, please, please make me one and send me one. I will use it and I will say who made it and tell them to subscribe to you, watch your videos and etc. Okay, so going back to my video. Uh, first thing you'll need is this icon art. This is a rocket doc. If you want to know how to get it, check out my channel. My video is there of how to get it. So, icon art. To download it, you're just going to have to open Firefox or Internet or Safari or whatever you want to use and go to this URL sucos.com dash preview and then a bunch of numbers I'll put it on the right of this screen on the more info tab in the description just download now it's less than a megabyte it's really small okay once you've downloaded it when you've downloaded it open icon art Right now, this video is pretty long, I think. It's going to be long. Right now, I'm going to teach you how to just make a simple little thing, just drawing it here. After this, I'll take you, tell you how to make a cooler one like mine. So just like draw anything you want. Just going to draw anything. Yeah, okay. Okay, pretend that's my arrow. And then I'm just going to put in a J. Okay, so first you draw whatever you want. That The pink color behind this is the most important part. This pink color is what is not going to show on the screen. Whatever you do not want to what do not want to see on your screen it has to be this pink color. So once you've drawn your thing your icon cursor thingy you just press set hotspot and this like crosshair is gonna appear and that's where your click will be so just put it at the edge of wherever you want your click to be I want mine to be there so I'm gonna accept I'm gonna file save frame as cursor remember this is just a simple thing I'm making it these are all my my my, my that's my cursor set I'm gonna save it to the desktop as test J and make sure you save it as cursor files dot c u r <clears throat> so save that once it's saved once it's saved uh, sorry just select it wait i'm just i just hide my icon so I'll just press that for them to show okay see this is your icon so what you want to do is you can close that <coughs> open up control panel and open up mouse that's gonna just press on the second tab, mine's in Portuguese, it says ponteiros yours will probably say cursor okay see this is my cursor set I haven't made it complete but these are all my things so just double click on on the, the default go to your desktop and here test J okay apply yes okay see my cursor it's not really good I just did it in like you saw less than 30 seconds okay so that's that's the simple cursor so I'm just gonna change it back okay wait a second okay so I've changed it back thanks for waiting and now I will teach you how to make a more complicated one so I'm just gonna delete that open up fireworks Adobe fireworks CS3 you can either use that or Photoshop and even if you don't have those and don't want to spend money on that get a program called paint.net I've got a video showing it showing you it 
how to get it, where to get it, how to use it, etc. It's like a free version of Photoshop, and it's not an illegal download. It's really for free. It was made to be for free. So just check that out if you do not want to spend money on these programs. I do, because well, I need to, to make these videos. Okay. So open that up. Make a new fabric document. And this is important. The canvas size has to be 32 by 32. The resolution, you can just leave it. Aha. Uh -huh. This is the tricky part. The canvas color. You're going to want to make it that special pink I told you. So just open up. I cannot again. Sorry. Open it up. Okay. Here it is opened and here wait first thing you just put them both wait okay so you're gonna want to make them both like this smaller so make the new document 32 by 32 resolution leave it how it is and here canvas color press that and just suck the color out of this pink over here and press it so that is the color you want your background to be. Just press OK. Let wait till it opens. Okay, this you can just close.